Hello Unity fans, I got a few requests to talk about the differences between Unity free and the paid version and why one should switch from free to pro. There are three versions now, first Unity free or personal, with that you can use all the core features of the engine, then the plus version, that you get for $35 per month, or the pro version, which costs $125 per month. So what are the differences or why should you for example switch from free to plus if you could use all the core features, right? Well, you have to use the plus plan currently if you make more than 100k of annual cross revenues or the raised funds exceeds this amount. But what are the real benefits of the plus version? Well, for me the best reason to switch to plus is that you get the essentials asset pack with assets worth up to $188. These are assets like MeshBaker for improving rendering performance, or .NET Tween Pro for nice transitions and UI animations, the Fog Volume asset for great atmospheric effects, and several VR assets. You can also add an own customizable splash screen to your game, which is very important for some guys, and you can switch the editor skin to a dark one. If you're working in a team, you can use an automated cloud build, which could really save some time. Collaboration features are included, which enable the members of the team to be easily informed about changes of the project. These team features are known as Unity Teams, which is also available as a separate subscription. Besides that, you can implement multiplayer features easily with up to 50 concurrent users hosted by Unity with a full access to high and low level APIs. Another benefit of the Plus plan is to access Unity's performance reporting so that you don't miss a bug, errors or high priority issues again. This means your project is locked, analyzed and errors are collected over platforms and devices automatically so that you can find and address issues quickly. You can use the plus plan if you gain 200k or less per year. If your annual revenues or funds are higher than this, you have to use the plus plan. With the pro, you have the same features as for the plus plan, but you can use the multiplayer feature with up to 200 concurrent users for example. So these are the facts, but here's how I use Unity. I'm creating my games as a solo indie developer and this is why I stick to the free version that you can use to create professional games, because all the core features of the engine are included. The only visible difference for the player of your game if you are using the free version for development is that the default splash screen is shown to him when the game is started, but let's be honest. If your game is fun to play, I don't think the user would refuse to play it just because it doesn't offer a custom splash screen. Ok, you don't have the great essentials pack, but for me it's cheaper to use the free version and pick the assets that I really need. And if I would develop my game in a team, I would think about signing in for Unity Teams or switch to the plus plan. Of course, you have to switch to the appropriate plan when your revenue exceeds 100k or 200k, but if this is the case, paying this amount wouldn't really hurt, right? So guys, these were my thoughts and experiences for developing games with Unity and the different plans. I really hope your questions are answered with that, and if you like my channel, please don't forget to subscribe to not miss a future video, and please add questions or ideas to the comments below. Thanks for watching this and see you soon.